This tech tip is brought to you by Hot Shots Secret, powered by science. All right, today's tech tip is all about modern engines and high-tech lubrication. Now, if you think about you know, today's engines, we've got downsized, turbocharged, four cylinders, six cylinders, having the output of a six cylinder, or eight cylinder, and heck, you know, when you talk about a GT500 or a Hellcat, you got eight cylinder engines making power of like 16 cylinders. So we've got lots of loads, lots of contact pressures. So what do we need? We need sort of modern lubrication to go with it. Well, nanotechnology as far as lubrication has been around for a long time, but it's got some challenges. Well, we skip those challenges, we look at what it can do for us, and it's talking about reducing wear, improving you know, the friction standpoint, uh, and it's also gonna give us efficiency, fuel economy, et cetera. Well, these challenges have been pretty difficult. So you have nanoparticles, extremely tiny microscopic particles. Uh, well, they can fall out of suspension, kind of like putting too much sugar in your, you know, your iced tea. Uh, it's gonna fall down to the bottom and create a lump. Well, that's not good. It can change the color, make it too dark. You know, we don't feel so good when we see black oil and it's brand new. Uh, and other challenges like that as well. But Hot Shot Secret has figured out how to fix those problems and given us FR3 friction reducer. Now this is great because if you think about a modern engine or any engine for that matter, you got a piston, you got a cylinder wall, and it's going up and down and it's dragging across these surfaces. Well, if you look closer at the surfaces, they have a lot of what they call asperities. It's not smooth. Uh, no matter what you machine, it's gonna have these rough surfaces. Well, nanotechnology can go in at the microscopic level. It's got a polarized molecule, so it's gonna stick to these machine surfaces. So it's gonna go in here and form kind of a boundary layer. It's gonna help create a better film thickness from the oil itself. So you're gonna have smoother running components that are gonna wear less, create less heat, and give you better fuel economy. Now, if you think about a piston going up and down, well, it goes up and stops, comes down and stops, and that's the worst thing you can do, because think about a, a water skier. He's skiing along, and all of a sudden the boat slows down. He's going down the oil film, the water film, until he hits dragging on the bottom of the lake. Uh, so here's your speed of your piston with these stop points at bottom dead center and top dead center. Now, by adding nanotechnology to your oil, you're gonna do a number of things. Improving shear and oxidation stability, improving film thickness, lowering friction and temperatures, along with the wear, improving your fuel economy. All great things, money back guarantee, hot shot secret, FR3 friction reducer. Check it out.